Welcome to Fishing Planet on Xbox. I'm Crazy Dave, and today we're still at San Joaquin Delta. Today we're going to be fishing for white sturgeons. Just to recap, this is day six. It costs $9,800 for your travel fee to get into the lake. And then your fishing license. Let's look at the fishing license. Uh, your fishing license cost eight thousand dollars for one day and twenty eight thousand eight hundred twenty two thousand eight hundred for a three day that's what I got is the three day so let's get ready to go to the lake oh no we got to do our setups setup is the Androx 11-2 Imperial Double Punch 6500, Mono 32 pound test, got an X Series Glowing Pear Shaped Bobber, got a 6 hot hook, we're using spawn sacks for bait. Now you can also use a bottom rod, so let me go ahead and show you the bottom rod setup, and uh, we'll look at it. It's a Mega Chubber 11.6, the Double Punch 6500 again, the Mono 32 pound test, my sinker is a 5.5 ounce, my Mono Leader, my, my Leader is a Mono Leader 0 0.1, that's 27 pound Leader. My hook is a 6 hot, and again we're using the Spine Sacks. Now, you can use the, uh, Uh, okay. Um, let's see, Jackie's in here. We'll just join Jackie in that room right there. It's our spawn point. And get this thing out of the way. Our spawn point is going to be fishing the beaver. Same place the carp was, but we're just going to fish on the other side. We're going to spawn in. You're just going to spin around. Oh, there's a guy fishing my spot. We'll go over here to the, to the right of him. It don't matter. It's just to just change the distance. Now, if you look out there, you can see a, a marker. That's where I caught, the, caught a 60-pound uh, one. was a uh, 10th on the leaderboard for that week. So when you cast... You want to cast out, I try to cast a little far, I try to show you. There's a shelf back there and you want to come right off the shelf. You watch, that bobber's leaning. You want to pull it up. No, nope, not quite, a little more. A little more. <coughs> <coughs> there we go, right there. We got a ding immediately when we came off that shelf. Uh, I didn't cover the fish net. Let's go ahead and take the time to cover it while we're sitting there waiting on a bite. I've got the fish castle large. It's a maximum single fish weight of 110 pounds. And uh, you're going to need that. Uh, these sturgeons, like I said, I caught a 60 pound one. So that 264 ain't going to cut it with only a 44 pound maximum weight. Alright, we're getting a bite here. Well, maybe not. There he is. Now, you might notice that I'm not using a, uh, a, um, rod holder. The way these fish bite, you'll have a slow minute. Nothing's biting on any of your rods, and then all your rods will, will uh, light up at once. So, uh, and then you end up losing all the fish but the one you got with these big old fish. It takes a minute to get them in. So, I don't use a, a rod stand. A lot of people do here. You can see this guy next to me. He's using one. But, uh, I didn't have no luck with them the way these fish bite. There he comes. Getting ready to come in, I think. Maybe he'll come in. 
see what we got here. All right, what do we have? Thirty-two pounds, fifteen hundred twenty-four dollars and three hundred two XP. I'll cast it back out here again. Get my pointer to work. Get her a little far then, a little too close. Cause we can come off that shelf. I just feel like I'm gonna cough at any minute. I'm trying to keep from coughing. I'm having a lot of trouble coughing on these videos. I know you don't wanna hear it. Try to do a breathing treatment, see if that helps, see if it maybe wouldn't cough, but all this talking makes me want to cough. So, uh, these fish, they run in schools, from what I can tell. You know, I have a slow point, like right now it's a slow point, but you notice everybody around me has got a slow point too, and then the fish will bite, and everybody will get a bite at one time. So then by the time you get the fish in, the school's gone, and you have to go to the next one. Wait for the next school to come along. So they're, they're schooling. Uh, I have caught uh, strapped bass, and, uh, oh, what's the other one? I can't think of the name of it now. I uh, can't think of what that other fish is that I caught here. Um, I can't think now, but you'll catch a couple of other kinds of fish here, striped bass and uh, whatever that fish that I can't come up with the name is, you'll catch them too, but I can't, for the life of me, I can't come up with a name. <coughs> 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 Terrible. Now this is a pretty good sized fish here. A little line wobble in it. You can see that line wobble, but it's hard to see at night. This is a pretty good sized fish right here. Let's see if we can get him in. Do not want to come in today. Pretty good size fish. Maybe we'll get lucky. Now there is no trophies or uniques here. Only commons. There's no trophy unique fight sturgeons, only commons. So all you're gonna catch here is commons, so here we go, here he comes. 52 pounds, $2,434 and 613 XP. Now that's a good fish. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy, that's a good one. Alright, it's about 2.37 at night. All the bites have dropped off. I think this is about it for us. We're not going to be able to fill our net tonight. So, we'll go in and look at our fish keep. It's, uh, we only got 266 pounds of fish. We got seven fish at $12,540. Steelhead, that was the other fish. I caught one of them. The uh, biggest fish I caught was 52 pounds. That was highlighted in the video. Um, you're going to have your good days and your bad days. If you stay a six, five, six, seven day trip, you're going to find out you're going to have good days and you're going to have bad days. That's what I like about this game. It's real realistic. So, uh, you don't just catch fish all the time. You got your good days, you got your great days, you got your bad days, and you got your worst days. Today was a bad day. But still, $12,000 isn't bad money. 
So I'm trying to get 10 likes on this video. So while you're thinking about it, go ahead and click that like button. Be sure and leave me a comment. Let me know that you've been here. Any questions that you may have. If you got a favorite fishing spot you want me to highlight, put all that in the comments. As always, hit that subscribe button so you can keep up with my, my upcoming content. This is Crazy Dave, and we'll see you next time. We're going to be at Louisiana fishing for flathead catfish and those big old alligator gars. Till then, we'll see ya.